YouTube channel so in today's video i'm gonna be doing like a life update and a day in my life i'm here with aziz we literally just woke up so in today's video we're gonna be going to like the museum and stuff this week is actually the last week that we have with my boyfriend being home so he was actually supposed to start his job last month he's a truck driver and he did like local truck driving like in the state but now he is going to be working for a different company and he's going to be on the road because when you go on the road as a trucker you make more money and you know we need more money right now because we got a baby and i don't really work now so like i just started like my little candle business but other than that like the only thing i do is youtube and youtube doesn't really pay that much like how it used to and i'm like excited but i'm also like not excited to be completely by myself with him being on the road like it's going to be a completely different experience so that's something that like I'm not looking forward to and then on top of that i just had my toe shortening surgery so i did shorten my other toe so i was grateful that i was able to have him for this long like taught me with the baby and then also like help take care of me with my toe recovering oh i also want to talk to you guys about like a procedure that's coming up that i'm getting done okay it's okay okay i'm about to get up right now but basically i told you guys that i wanted to get a bbl but a lot of doctors told me that it wasn't safe because of my butt implants so i'm actually going to do something else instead but stay tuned for the video when i talk about it Okay guys, I got the lunch packs. So we got some sandwiches, some hot chips, some beverages, watermelon, and then for Aziz. And Aziz fell asleep while I was making the sandwiches, so I'm about to wake him up because I gotta get him ready. Okay, you guys, so it has been about a week since we went to the museum. I ended up ending that vlog because Aziz got sick and I had to take care of him. And last week was just super hectic taking care of Aziz. And then it was the last week that Arath was here and now he's at work in another state. He won't be home for a few days. So I just had a whole bunch of stuff to do last week. So I ended up having to end the vlog there. But I did want to touch base on a few things that I did mention in the intro of this video. The first thing is my toe. So I did get my second toe shortened and the doctor filmed the entire surgery being done. So I will have that vlog coming out for you guys. And then also about my BBL and getting my butt implants removed. So in my last day of my life vlog, I did say that I wanted to get a BBL, but a lot of doctors were telling me that it wasn't safe because of my butt implants. So I decided that I was just going to get my butt implants removed and then get a BBL done on my actual butt. But they were also telling me that that wasn't safe. So I decided just to keep my butt implants because I've had them for already like seven or eight years and I haven't had any problems with them so I decided that I'm gonna do only liposuction I'm gonna do lipo 360 lipo on my arms and my chin but I'm not gonna get that done until next year because I want the baby to be at least one years old and then this month I am gonna be getting butt injections it's not like the sculpture that I've done in the past I'll put pictures 
um i've gotten sculpture in the past but that's something that doesn't really last and it's not going to give you big like bbl full results it's just something that like goes away and then comes back a little bit but the injections that i'm getting are supposed to be a non-surgical bbl and give you big results with the filler it's basically like lip filler and it is semi-permanent if you get enough of it it can last forever there is a girl that i talked to She's like a famous Fashion Nova model. She also had butt implants, just like me, and she had three BBLs, and she said that the butt injections gave her the best results out of everything. Her results look amazing, and just the fact that she also had butt implants, just like me, and she got it over her butt implants. And then I asked the doctors about it as well here and the spa that I went to, and all of them said that it is safe for me to get. So I decided just to do that. The doctor who does it is from London, and I was gonna go to him next year when after I got my lipo, but he is gonna be in Canada this month. So I decided just to take advantage of the fact that he's in Canada because it's so much closer to me and there's really no downtime at all. I'll only be there for two days. I'll literally fly there, get it done, and come home the next day. So I am getting those butt injections done this month and then the light bulb will be done next year. But I will bring you guys along with me, record it being done, show you guys what it looks like after and what it looks like months after to see if it actually lasted and it is as big as I want it to be. But other than that, you guys, I'm just going to take you guys along with me for the rest of the day. Okay, you guys, I'm just going to eat my breakfast. And then after that, I'm going to film some content for some Halloween candles that I have coming up. All right, you guys, I'm going to take some content pictures of the candle that I have coming out for Halloween. It's called Poison. It's pumpkin caramel crunch flavored. It's so freaking cute. I wish you guys could smell it. But this is the little setup I have. And then Aziz is just right here in his little Halloween outfit. And I have the Nightmare Before Christmas on. Ignore my house that it's so messy. And then I have like this little witch hat. So I'm probably going to like take some pictures of the candle and then do like a little reel. Okay, you guys, I finished filming the little candle. We also filmed a little reel together. So I'll post that so you guys can see. In honor of Halloween, me and my little pumpkin here are going to be making a potion for you guys. We just have to add the final ingredient. Oh my god! He did such a good job on the little reel. Um, I also took pictures and stuff just of the candle. So I'll have my website for that linked below. Or I'll see if I can show it to you guys. Yeah, it looks like that. I feel like I'm putting so much effort into these freaking candles, you guys. Because I feel like for the first time in my life, I'm not doing anything. I'm just being a stay-at-home mom. Which I know there's nothing wrong with that. But I'm used to always working. You guys know I worked at the club. Then I was like doing YouTube full-time. And now I'm just like being a mom and having to rely on someone else which kind of scares me because I'm not used to that. So I'm really trying to like, you know, have these candles be successful so I can have something too, you know? But yeah, you guys, I'm pretty much just gonna make some food right now and then I'm also gonna feed the baby. Okay, me and Aziz pretty much just been lazy and sleeping all day and like just chilling. So now we're about to make dinner. I'm just gonna make a frozen pizza because I'm lazy right now. And then I'm gonna give Aziz this cereal. Um, I actually wanted you guys advice because I've only given that to him once before. He is five and a half months and I've only given him the bottle. I'll put like a little clip of his first time trying it. A few days ago, me and Araf gave it to him. So this is gonna be my second time giving it to him. But I don't know at what age you're supposed to give it to them or how because when I try to feed it to him, he tries sucking on it like as if it's a bottle because he's only used to eating the bottle. So let me know because I don't know if I'm supposed to start giving him food now or like if that little cereal is considered food. My cousin gave it to her son and they're like the same age so that's why I'm like trying it. But definitely please give me tips down below but we're about to eat really quick. Alright, I got Aziz in his little PJs. They say, I love mommy to the moon and back. And they have little stars. They're so cute. Oh my god, Aziz. Okay, maybe we're not ready for bed. Okay, you guys, he's not quite ready for bed. He still wants to be up and play. And then I'm going to read him this little book. Um, He can't really understand it, obviously. But it has, like, little words and stuff. So he could touch and feel. Look, see? He actually, I don't know if you can tell. He's actually looking at it. Like, he actually pays attention to it when I show him. So I'm just going to read him this little book. Look, he tries grabbing it and, like, opening it. 
himself. And then we're gonna go to bed. And then once he falls asleep, I'm gonna like change into my PJs and brush my teeth and stuff. So that's pretty much it for this vlog, you guys. I hope you liked it. Stay tuned for my next video, which is gonna be me getting my butt shots. So if you guys like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Thank you.